Mnangagwa humiliates Mohodi, Kozembi. A recent video clip circulating on social media has sparked widespread reactions as Zimbabwe's president, Emerson Mnangagwa, appears to have committed a serious faux pas by forgetting the name of his own deputy, Kembo Mohodi, during a public event. The incident, which occurred in front of dignitaries, has not only raised eyebrows but also ignited discussions about leadership etiquette and unity efforts within the nation. In the video, Umningogwa can be seen struggling to recall Mohodi's name, leading to an awkward moment as he attempts to address his deputy. Such a blunder on a public platform not only undermines Mohodi's position but also reflects poorly on Umningogwa's leadership capabilities. Furthermore, Umningogwa's attempt to speak Ndebeli, a language spoken by the Ndebeli people of Zimbabwe, as a means to portray himself as a unifying figure, also fell short of expectations. His evident struggle with the language only added to the discomfort of the situation, highlighting the importance of authenticity and genuine efforts in fostering unity among diverse communities. Adding insult to injury, Umningogwa's addressing of his minister Kozembi Kozembi as a boy has drawn sharp criticism from many quarters, with some interpreting it as a disrespectful gesture. Such language not only diminishes the dignity of the individual addressed but also reflects poorly on Umningogwa's respect for his own government officials. The incident serves as a reminder of the importance of leadership decorum and respect within the political sphere. Leaders must not only possess the ability to remember the names of their colleagues but also demonstrate humility, inclusivity, and respect for diversity. In a country striving for unity and progress, such blunders only serve to erode public confidence and undermine efforts towards nation-building. Umningagwa, as the head of state, must take heed of the reactions to this incident and work towards fostering an environment of mutual respect and understanding among all citizens, regardless of their background or position. Ultimately, Umningagwa's memory mishap and linguistic struggles underscore the need for leaders to lead by example, showing empathy, humility, and inclusivity in their words and actions. Only through genuine efforts to bridge divides and promote unity can Zimbabwe move forward towards a brighter and more prosperous future. Please like, comment, share and follow this channel for more information or updates on news and entertainment.